How do you fit in the, uh, the training there with the community work that you do? Um, yeah, it's always great to work with my community and everything as well. I grow, uh, grew up and uh, it's, it's good, good to give back to the kids and uh, teach them, pass down uh, my knowledge. And um, looking at your last past two fights, you had a doctor stoppage and a technical retirement. Yeah. Uh, like, what are your thoughts on your past two fights and has it been frustrating that you haven't gotten the finish per se? Yeah, it, at, the, at the time, on the night, it's probably a bit frustrating because I want to get the finish and everything. But um, like a couple of weeks go past and, and, and it's a, win, a win's a win, do you know what I mean? I don't lose and, uh, like, I, um, a, win's, a win's a win for me, do you know what I mean? And, and it's, like, it's like the referee or the doctor and it's classed as a win, do you know what I mean? So we're, we're, it's, it's the opponent what can't carry on. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with it. And your thoughts on Jimmo as an opponent and how would you rank his first knockout out of 10? I don't know, I'm not bothered about his first knockout. And um, I think he's a, he's a great opponent. He's 18 and two, he's only lost two in, tw in 20 fights. And um, I respect him a lot, he's a, he's, a, he's a great fighter. He wouldn't be in the UFC if he wasn't. And, um, but um, I'm gonna impose my, 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 um, my, my fighting style on him and, and see how he copes. We'll see, if I, if, if I decide to take him down, use my wrestling and use my jiu-jitsu, then, um, then I will, just like I did with Dear De Barty and that. And um, if I decide to take him down and submit him and everything, then I will.